what's up what's going on pisces people i'm back with another video welcome back to the channel quick quick message quick update i'm not taking personals y'all i know i know i just have a lot going on i'm moving i have a lot of things in the works right now um so i'm not taking personals but good news is my partner keen is taking personals you guys can go to their website especially if you haven't been before and check out all of their spiritual advisors i actually just got a reading done because like i said y'all i have a lot of things in motion right now and especially with my career and such i spoke to a, a spiritual advisor over on keen and she provided a lot of insight for me really gave me you know a little bit more confidence to some new ideas that I'm pursuing right now. I really, really appreciated the conversation I had over there. I definitely saved this spiritual advisor so that I can go back and reach back out to her next time, okay? So if you're interested, the link will be below, especially if you've never used Keen before, you can save up to $99 by using my link. It's gonna give you your first 10 minute reading for only $1.99. All right, so let's hop into this reading. You guys, I just came back from a trip from New Orleans and I got a, oops, one of these cards was already flipped. I got a new deck out there. All right, it's a little spooky a little bit, but you know, had to get into the mood of New Orleans. I got the Hoodoo Tarot deck. So I really love it because you know, Hoodoo y'all is, is an African um, type of spirituality that has been passed you know through the generations and you know it's pretty interesting to me so i really wanted to pick up something with the energy of new orleans just to see you know our, our good our good ancestors see what they got for us okay all right so let's get into it this is the major um arcana deck also y'all this is um this is the Major Arcana deck, um, Lovely Lady Oracles. I'll leave the link to that one below as well, and the Hoodoo Tarot, all right? But let's start out with this going to shuffle. What are the messages for Pisces watching? God, Angel, Spirit, Universe. God, Angel, Spirit, Universe. Holy Spirit, okay? We want the good Holy Spirit up in this piece. All right, what are the messages for Pisces watching at this time? All right, got the three of cords. Y'all, and I have a little, I have a little um, guidebook here because these cards are not traditional, but for the most part, intuitively, I can just kind of figure them out. You guys, I'm thinking about starting a little tarot course as well and like how I read tarot because everybody reads it differently, but like, some of these cards are not traditional tarot cards, but me just using my instincts and my intuition and what I already know, I'm able to kind of just, you know, bring it together. So starting off with the three of coins here, this is a very beautiful card. This person, this woman almost looked like Beyonce a little bit, don't she? All right. Very, very beautiful. All right. Three of coins here. We got Dr. Buzzard in the middle. Now, this is a card, like I said, y'all, I don't know the, the meaning of this, you know, Dr. Buzzard. I'm used to the traditional tarot, but because of this imagery here, I see the Libra scales here. So I'm really getting justice vibes. All right. I see we got like a building in the back. It's giving me constitution. It's getting me, giving me Confederate, you know, Confederacy, all types of stuff legally. All right. So some of you guys could be contemplating some sort of legal career or there's someone here who feels like there is a just situation or a situation that needs to be handled justly, all right? We got four of coins here, which is uh, traditionally four of pentacles, all right? So for one, we got a lot of coins, a lot of pentacles energy here. I feel like money is really something on the forefront right now, making money, working, collaborating, um, trying to figure out where you can best put your resources all right and like i said some of you guys are dealing with something regarding law maybe you have some sort of court case coming up or you are studying law or something like that okay there's also a man here in the middle i mean there's two men there's an older man and there's a younger man all right i see with the four of coins here some of you guys could be dealing with someone who it doesn't have much to give okay or you feel like pisces like this is such interesting imagery here because i think this is like a wishbone in this um 
guy's hand and if y'all know anything about wishbones it's like usually if you find a wishbone you pull it you and somebody else pulls it and whoever has the larger piece you know it's kind of like you get the you make you get to make the wish you're the lucky one right but this person has both parts in their hand it's like they don't want to even risk you know pulling that with someone else because maybe they won't get the luck that they deserve okay so i feel like somebody could be holding back from giving you something or from sharing something because they feel like they feel like they may, they may be setting themselves short if they allow you in in that in that way all right and somebody feels like they definitely need to um weigh something out with you like something is just not it's not balanced here all right with 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 these scales and this guy in the middle there could be someone older trying to come in and make things right all right it could have to do with money somebody you work with all right or somebody who wants to make things work with you all right i'm just checking this guidebook really quick to make sure I want to see if I'm off right here or is this really the the justice card in this deck which I feel like it is yes it is y'all it is the justice card dr. buzzard here okay and the image of this card it says is dr. buzzard standing in front of the courthouse laughing joyfully behind him is lady justice okay and it says dr. buzzard symbolizes the domination and bringing law into the picture okay now this is interesting because i see a lady and i see a man all right so i do feel like some of y'all are dealing with a romantic situation where you feel like somebody could be laughing or taking something lightly but lady justice here the feminine energy is 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 seeming like justice needs to be served OK, it's honestly like this person is enjoying their life, but hanging over their head is justice. The thought of justice, the thought of not bringing someone justice or knowing that they owe someone some sort of justice. All right. And I keep looking back at this three of coins. This girl is not playing about her money. Like, do y'all see this? This imagery here? My nails. We got a wad of cash here on the table. OK, she's trying to manifest some more shit here. We got a crystal ball. Y'all, I'm so sorry. This is going to be age restricted now because I just, I just cussed. Okay. So Lord, <laughs> but anyways, y'all see this? She's not playing about her money. Okay. Look at her eyes here. She's going to get what she deserves. Okay. So somebody feels like you're not playing and somebody's fun could be coming short. It's getting cut short because they know they have to give towards you or, or a situation that they owe you. All right. Somebody feels like their luck is going to be ending really soon unless they give you what you deserve. OK, let's see if we can clarify this. What's this justice here? This Dr. Buzzard, God, Angel, Spirit, Universe. What's this for Pisces watching at this time? All right. We have mother of coins in the reverse. OK, a lot of money. Like I was saying, y'all, this has to do with money here. All right. Mother of coins upright. This lady looks well rested. She looks like she has everything she needs. She's providing a lot of energy, a lot of resources, a lot of abundance to these animals around her. A lot of growth is happening, all right? But in the reverse, I feel like there's something about this situation where you cannot rest, all right? You're not getting what you deserve. Someone's having a hard time sleeping. Someone feels like they don't have everything that's, that they need to um, provide. And that could be because you're waiting on some sort of justice to come here. All right, you could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius in particular. All right, but somebody is, is literally waiting. They're having sleepless nights because they're waiting for something to come in that they know they deserve. For some of y'all, it's money. Somebody promised you something to give you something, owe you something. Buy this mother of coins in the reverse for Pisces watching. 
We got the seven of coins, y'all. I shuffled this deck very well. I've already done a reading with it. So the fact all these coins is coming out, money is on your mind, money's on your mental. Right now, it's one of it's one of the most important things is your financial security, your foundation. All right. Some of you guys in the past have let your emotions run away from you. You've let your emotions overcome your money, overtake your work, overtake your learning, your your thought process. You're not allowing that to happen anymore. All right, finances, stability, all of that is very important to you. In the seven of coins, you feel like you've invested something with someone or you have invested your time and energy doing something and you're waiting for that return. All right, I feel like it's just a matter of time. It's just a matter of time. Some of y'all have put in a lot of work, a lot of energy towards something. And you're just waiting for the payoff. You're just waiting for it to pay off. You're waiting, waiting, waiting. But it's going to come in. It's going to pay off. It's going to pay off. It's not going to be overnight. This is something you have to wait on. We have the daughter of knives. And we have the five of knives here, all right? So there's some sort of conflict here. Could be with the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, all right? Somebody's mouth is lethal, you hear me? Somebody got them daggers. It could be you, Pisces. It could be somebody else. But somebody know how to cut where it hurts. And they don't have to pull out a knife, okay? They just use their mouth. You see this lady's tongue sticking out with these swords? Yeah, your mouth is lethal or somebody's mouth here is def definitely lethal in an argument. Five of swords. There's been conflict between you and another person, all right? Daughter of knives is someone wanting to communicate and someone holding back communication, all right? I feel like they want to communicate. They, it's a lot of mental congestion in regards to this situation that you may be in with somebody, Pisces. Anyone you had a conflict with mentally, you and this person are thinking about this situation. All right, why this daughter of knives for Pisces? And we got Big Mama, the sun. All right, Big Mama is the sun. Look at that. Look at that good old cornbread, okay? Lord, I love me some cornbread. All right, so yeah, I feel like there's a positive resolution here, okay? If you have fallen out with anyone, Pisces, could be a Leo in particular, all right? This could be about money. This could be about someone owing you something. You could have said something in the midst of an argument that was very brutal or vice versa. Somebody said something to you that was very brutal. It cut very deep, okay? End of the day, sun here, big mama energy, all, all, all is well, okay? Peace will be brought to this situation here. Um, this is a joyful outcome between you and whoever else or just overall. Let's see. Let's clarify. I feel like it's just a joyful outcome, period. We got Father Sims, with it, which is temperance, and it's in the reverse. It was in the reverse. And we got Six of Knives, which is Six of Swords, and it was in the reverse, right? So, yeah, somebody can't wait to come back towards this situation because this is where happiness lies, all right. That's what the sun is about here. That's what big mama is here to do. All right. Bring things into um, the light. And what's important here, what's been brought into the light is that this connection that you have or this thing that you've been working on, that you're waiting for the payoff here, it's going to provide you your ultimate happiness. OK, so some of you guys mentally have been thinking about moving away from something that you've invested time in. Could be a person, could be a you know, a project, an idea, a new career path, something. It has stressed you out mentally and sometimes financially to the point where y'all feel like y'all want to move away from it. You want to give it up. You want to leave it behind. OK, there's a lot of impatience here. OK, but if you wait on this, Pisces, if you wait for things to divinely play out for for father time to really shake things out and equal things out here. All right. Weigh out the scales of justice. You're going to get what you deserve and it's going to be ultimate fulfillment and happiness. I mean, look how warm this card is. Look how warm and inviting. You know what I'm saying? There's something very, very joyful in your future. OK, I feel like more joy than what you're used to. Because all these cards before look like stress. They look like turmoil. They look like you're waiting for people to F you over. All right. You're waiting for people to not get, bring you justice. You got to remind people, hey, you you know, you said you was going to do this. Are you going to do it? Remember when I did this? Are you going to do like come on, give my have my back like I had your back? All of this has been a long time coming. 
all right so I, I feel like patience is what's needed here for you to get your your ultimate fulfillment okay some of you guys have mother figures here i see two um we got two of the mother cards here um some of you guys are mother figures or you will be father figures as well all right so you try to remain balanced as best as you can you try not to let these disappointments get to you most importantly don't give up on the seeds that you have planted all right these seeds will manifest they will bloom they will turn out to be something in your favor all right i'm gonna pull a major arcana from the lovely lady oracle deck and just see what's the major arconic energy here for pisces watching at this time guys all right so we have the tower okay There's something major happening or something major happened either a breakup um, maybe you lost some sort of job, ended some sort of job here, and we got the Hierophant. All right, spiritually, you're up-leveling due to whatever has brought you any sort of strife, okay? There's something here with the Tower that's really giving that you are having a hard time dealing with the changes that have been brought upon you, okay? This could be a breakup, it could be a separation, like I said, it could be a job ending, new career, moving, transitioning, whatever it is, spiritually, it's bringing you closer to where you need to be, all right? And then also we got with the Hierophant here, it's, it's giving that like, if you had a breakup or a separation, it's ultimately leading you towards a higher level of commitment. All right, whether that be with this person or whether it be with somebody else, you are moving from an unfounded, unstable situation into stability. All right, into stability and calm energy and enlightenment and, you know, progressing yourself spiritually. And sometimes you don't get that progression without going through a lot of pain and turmoil. All right, and some of y'all just have to have the, these foundations ripped from underneath of you because they're not secure they're not they're not secure all right so pisces i truly hope these messages helped you that reading was crazy it was a little intense like i don't even really know uh where a lot of those messages came from um but let me know if it resonated in the comments below and also make sure if you want a personal reading check out my sponsor keen where you can get your first 10 minute reading for only a dollar 99 and that is up to literally 99 dollars in savings all right so don't miss it the link is below i'll check y'all out later bye